Still stuck using Safari like it's just a plain browser? You're tapping through tabs, dodging pop-ups, switching apps to translate, or take notes, and wondering, why doesn't Safari just do more? If that sounds familiar, you've probably felt the same three things. You can't find extensions easily, you're unsure what's safe to install, you don't know what's slowing Safari down anymore, in this video, you'll learn exactly how to install, manage, and fine-tune Safari extensions on macOS Sequoia, step-by-step. Step. Let's get started. Let's start with a small story. Last year, I switched between three browsers just to stay productive. Chrome had tools, Safari had speed, Firefox had flexibility. But then I realized... Safari extensions could bring everything I needed into one clean browser. So what are Safari extensions? They're mini apps that live inside Safari and extend its functionality. They can block ads, manage tabs, save content, autofill forms, or even help with privacy. Some are simple tools, others work in the background and handle automation. The big misunderstanding is that people think Safari can't compete with Chrome's web store. Wrong. Apple curates extensions through the Mac App Store, so what you're getting is far more optimized and secure. Here's the first real step. Go to your Mac Safari app. Click Safari in the top menu. Choose Settings. You'll now see all the installed extensions. At the bottom right, click More Extensions. This launches the Safari Extension section in the Mac App Store. Now pause for a moment. Don't just start downloading. Want something specific? Use the search bar at the top left of the App Store window. Try typing names like One Blocker, Mate Translate. If you're coming from Chrome, search for a tool you loved. Many are available on Safari too. Look through categories, top free extensions, top paid extensions, browsing, noir, tab space, momentum, reading extensions, mate, instapaper, good links, check ratings and reviews. Safari extensions are often lighter than Chrome's, but just as powerful, especially if you're on Apple Silicon. Once the extension is installed, go to Safari. Settings, Extensions. You'll see your extension listed on the left panel, e.g., Add Guard for Safari. Check the box next to the extension to enable it. This activates the extension and reveals its options on the right side of the window. On the right side, you'll see the extension's details. You can choose to allow the extension in private browsing by checking the box. Under Permissions, click Edit Websites or Always Allow on every website. You can decide which websites the extension can access, whether it can read or alter content on those pages, whether it can view your browsing history. Here is a pro tip. It's best to start with limited access. Just enable it for specific sites you trust. You can always expand access later. Let's say something's slowing down Safari, or you installed something useless. Open Safari Settings, Extensions tab again. You'll see all installed extensions listed. To temporarily disable, uncheck the box next to it. It stays installed but won't run. To uninstall completely, click the extension's name. A small uninstall button appears. Confirm it, and it's gone from your Mac. Quick tip, if Safari feels slower or buggy, disable all extensions, then re-enable them one at a time. You'll know which one's the troublemaker. Customize your Safari toolbar. Right-click anywhere on the Safari toolbar. Choose Customize Toolbar. Drag in or out extension icons you use often. Keep only what you actually use. Clean setup equals faster browsing. Set keyboard shortcuts, if supported. Go to Mac System Settings, Keyboard, Shortcuts. Scroll down to App Shortcuts. Add Safari-specific ones for extensions. 
It's a hidden gem, especially for power users. Here's what most Mac users never figure out. Safari is only basic if you never tweak it. You now know how to find high quality extensions, install and safely enable them, manage and remove what you don't need, optimize settings for privacy and speed, most people stop at installing, but managing your extensions is what separates a good browser from a great one. Here's a challenge. Build your Essential 5, your 5 Safari extensions that make your daily browsing smoother, faster, and safer. Don't just install, install with purpose. Let's make Safari your tool, not just Apple's.